Let's talk about charity organizations and your uh, commitment to the community, your relationship with the community. Uh, so I have been on an organization, a nonprofit called The Bridge for, I think it's been over a year now. And The Bridge builds affordable housing uh, mm -hmm. for the homeless, for people who are on the street who suffer from mental illness and drug addiction. And not only do we build the homes, but we also provide services. And we've done 28 buildings to date. Um, and we had our last uh, board meeting actually here in this building upstairs. Um, but it's great because we're helping people who are out on the streets. Many times that you see the people in the city that are sitting in subways or mm -hmm. sitting on the street, you know, I talk to a lot of those people and uh, they don't have ID. They don't, they, they're just struggling. They don't have anything. And some of them need help. Some of them are suffering from drug addiction. Some of them need services because they have some sort of a mental illness. And of course, there is a segment of the people that are on the street that are, could be dangerous. And, and that's something different. But a lot of those people, they say roughly 70% just need help, need support. And so what my organization does um, is help those people. And it's a really uh, great group of people who are focused on trying to get people in better places. Um, and they say you can tell a lot about a society by how they treat their most vulnerable, right? Mm -hmm. And so we haven't done such a great job as of late uh, in New York City. We can do much better and we're, we're working towards that. And it's great that you understand the business. You can probably brainstorm and, mm -hmm. and have a vision where you should be building uh, affordable housing for, uh, for those people that uh, you can create a better atmosphere for more of them. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's the people that have been invited. The bridge has been around for 50 years, believe it or not. And uh, the people that have been involved with the bridge, like Cynthia Wainwright and uh, uh, Susan, all the, there's just a, Amy Norman and Susan Wiviet. There's all of those people just care deeply about making sure that they take care of people. And, uh, you know, when you have so much and you're given so much, you kind of have an obligation uh, to take care of others. I think it was Muhammad Ali who said, you know, um, yeah, giving back to people is the rent you pay for being here. Like you have to help people, you have to do something. And I think all of us, yeah, I mean, it's, it's really, it's really what we're supposed to do. It's not, you shouldn't be rewarded for it. It's kind of like, if more of us did that, I think we'd be in a, in a better place in, a better in the place. country overall. Well, I totally agree with you. In the, everywhere, everywhere you go, it's in every mm -hmm. state and in every Well, town. when you stop thinking about yourself, you know, me, 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 and what can I get and what do I have and material stuff, it's hard because, you know, we're so focused on social media and comparison. I call it comparison quicksand because it's constant and it's the worst for teenagers because all they do is see what everybody else has and what they don't have. And so I think if we let, spent less time on that, I'm even trying to do that myself and more time in the real world doing other stuff, uh, you'll end up feeling better about yourself. Well, social media does suck you in a bit. That's true. <laughs> a bit? I mean, people I know spend hours a day watching. I mean, I'll be honest with you. There was a few weeks ago where I, I was like watching these videos over and these reels. They send you like if you like stand up like Dave Chappelle or they'll keep sending you and you're like, you just keep going. And I was like, ooh, my son was like, mom, you've been on there for 20 minutes. So <laughs> you have to put it down yeah. after a period of time. You it's, just do. Yeah. Not good. Read a book. That's why I say read a book. <laughs> exactly. I, I agree with you.